Yo, what's up guys? This is day five of my journey to 2200 and we get a 2073 rated opponent from Poland. Okay. Um, this one, so the perk or the modern. Okay, I don't know, A6, um, probably idea is B5, so I'm just gonna throw in A4. I'm out of theory here, so I'm just gonna have to play moves that kinda make sense. Playing F3 because my idea is queen to d2 and I don't want this knight to jump in here. Okay, um, g4 or long castles? So e5 is coming, um, I'm gonna play this move. I mean, I'm gonna go long castles anyways. What if he goes b5, then I can just take, because I have knight, knight b8. So yeah, let's go long castles and let's have a fun game. Okay, he's play playing extremely fast. I guess maybe this is theory, I don't know. Um, yeah, let's go g4 and then h4. Okay, wow. I did not expect this move. Take with the bishop, I guess. Um, check, just block. I feel like he's he knows the moves, I don't know. <laughs> like he's playing extremely fast. Okay, so this is the idea. Um, what can I do? I can go back. Can go back maybe. Okay, how will I defend? Can go with this move as well. Just this one. I feel like I need more pieces. Like this move just seems too slow, right? Yeah, I just don't see anything. Like knight takes, okay, he goes there. Now I think still this move. Yeah, I think still this move. Um, he does have this one. Maybe I should have taken, I don't know. Yeah, because now this check is a problem, right? Um, let's go, let's go with takes, check, I take, he takes, hmm, yeah, so let's go back, I don't see anything else, this move, what should I do, I don't know. Um, so what I'm gonna try to do is get my king out, so this knight is gonna be unpinned. This move, I don't know. Um, I mean I can counter attack. But then still knight check. Yeah, maybe I have to go... I mean if I take... If I take, then this knight joins. If I move back, he takes. I take knight takes probably and then take, I mean he can just win a pawn at least. If I go here he takes, I take, he goes check, I go take, he goes take, I go um, let's say queen I don't know, queen somewhere, he takes, or he takes with the rook, move my king, and then he takes the pawn. If I move back, he takes, and let's see what happens. Just move back and then g5. Okay. g5, knight here, what do I do? I just take, I guess, and then take. I'm again down a bunch of time, but like, I don't know what, what else to do. So my idea was uh, queen takes. 
because this also opens up my king. Probably the best thing for him is just to just to like take the pawn or something. Check, I still go here, he goes here and do I just lose the knight? Wait, I just lose the knight, right? <laughs> Wait. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I just lose the knight. Nice. Okay. So I guess I take this one. He takes, I move. And then we'll see. No, I don't lose the knight. What am I talking about? I can defend, obviously. But I at least lose a pawn. Yeah, I have two rooks. Um, so if I go here, rook takes. Just rook takes, huh? Here, rook takes, go here, no, but also the knight is hit. Yeah, I think I'm just totally lost, but I mean, I have to go for this, I don't see anything else. Yeah, rook takes. Um, yeah, this is just GG, I think. Um, what can I even do? If I take, obviously, uh, maybe I try this one. So take, I don't know. Um, okay, yeah, he was ready for that. <laughs> um, maybe I go here. Wait, does check do anything? <laughs> the problem is I have this move in. If g5 wasn't here, I would be winning, because check and this move. I mean, I have to do this one, right? I just don't know if I should include the check. Probably not, because the queen should defend the knight. Go back. Now he will obviously take. Um, I guess I take... Wait. If I take with the king, I just get back rank mated. So I should take with the knight. Oh. I didn't even see that. Nice. And yeah, that's gonna be GG. I'm just gonna resign. <laughs> Not gonna fight back in this position. And let's see the game. Um, yeah, I mean, I just didn't know any opening theory. And he was probably... Uh, like, he probably had a lot of experience in this position. So 86 against 74 and a 1900 against 2200 performance um yeah let's see so this was correct and then castles was a major mistake somehow i don't know why uh but it is because okay this is correct so yeah i was just losing immediately with with this move and yeah i'm just totally lost out of the opening. I did play best moves, which was nice. And now knight a3, why does this work? Because I can take, I didn't even, I just, I didn't even calculate. Like I just saw knight a3 takes. Yeah, knight a3. Only winning move is takes. And then I take back. And then only I mean, he can go bishop e6 or bishop a4. Bishop a4, bishop e6. Okay. Yeah, I don't know why I didn't even consider knight a3. Um, okay. But yeah, now obviously it's lost. He takes. Yeah, knight takes just... If I included the check... Um, if I go here, bishop f8... And then here, check, I guess, yeah, then he just takes the knight, or maybe he takes this one first, or not, I mean, it doesn't matter, no, this one I can take, I guess, yeah, um, okay, so now let's look at how can I play better next time in the opening, I mean, this move I'm just not familiar with, a6, like usually knight here and then this move. 
and then let's say castles queen d2 um okay c5 apparently but like let's say here and then long castles yeah um and if so he played a6 i shouldn't go a4 or maybe i should i don't know knight f3 no i'm not gonna play knight f3 let's say just queen d2 but then b5 yeah and i i don't like allowing like why would i allow b5 so that's why a4 he played knight f6 i played f3 he played here and now i should go just h4 immediately or queen d2 is still fine castles and i'll just h4 okay so i just shouldn't castle that's what what about g4 g4 is wrong because e5 push knight d4 ah yeah so bishop d3 okay yeah but this is this is nasty let's say i start with this move okay so this is fine yeah knight g2 e2 because this move here he doesn't have this one right so he has to go back and then g4 and yeah okay so against a6 i should remember do not castle um yeah okay. but why h4 i mean he can just go here bishop c4 then okay um, i don't know um so again if i see a6 i should go just like normal development then here and then no if i see a6 i go a4 obviously to prevent uh, to prevent b5 let's say he develops obviously this move to stop knight to g4 castles queen d2 um and then okay he can go c5 immediately but this is weird this is just weird uh because i can take and take and he's just down a pawn and i mean yes he has some compensation but i don't know um so yeah nobody's gonna play c5 knight c6 is a move wait what did he play yeah he played knight c6 and then castles and now just g4 or not now yeah this one this one knight g to e2 um bishop d7 g4 b5 why can i not take i mean i can but best move is just h4 h4 here knight d1 okay i guess but let's say i take a b a b here just take check ah he gets this one yeah or not queen a5 back rook b8 okay he, he again has this pressure but at least my king isn't isn't on, on b1 um so that's why h4 he should go h5 um i would go like takes maybe no but then knight takes yeah okay now i castle what here let's say queen b8 take take g5 is just g5 i mean come on closing closing off the attack i don't know knight e8 knight takes i don't know yeah i'll just take probably because this move h5 really like kills the kills the game knight d5 also possible but now just takes yeah what take take <laughs> and still castles i mean okay i guess what about this move gf gf let's say i go here maybe okay and then this move and i take and then e5 okay or i have to check forcing me to take with the queen i mean with the with the king yeah this one obviously is losing because of um because of e5 um yeah i mean okay so 
Against the modern, if I see a6, I shouldn't castle. That's the takeaway from this game and hope you guys enjoyed the video. See you next time.